This warehouse on 3rd Avenue may not look like much, but this warehouse houses the works of R215. In this class, students can work with different mediums like wood and clay to create different pieces of art. And according to our professor Melissa McLeod, this helps the students decide what they want to focus on later in their college careers. The whole thing is so that they get um, through all their foundations a, a taste of everything and they know what they enjoy and can make a more informed decision, you know, like when they go forward and choose a major. For their wood projects, the students created works of art that display different things, like the intricacies of the mind, made an environmental statement, or simply defied the laws of gravity. The class also lets students express their love of art in vastly different ways. It's a definitely new experience. I've never dealt with like hands-on projects like this. So this was my first time ever working with like actual tools and just with my hands. So it's like a really huge learning experience. For their final project, the students of R215 will be trading in the safety goggles as woodwork with the welding helmets as steelwork. And although it's an intimidating task, the students are very excited for the opportunity. Steel is intimidating, but I'm excited to work with it. I'm excited to learn welding because I think stereotypically welding is seen as like a man's thing. So it's kind of cool to get to try something new and look kind of bad, bad doing it. No matter what path these students take, one thing is for sure. They can thank Art215 for showing them that art can mean much more than a brush on a canvas. Colton Jeffries, MU Report.